The key point, Angela, is this. The Southeast has five states. President Gula Jonathan will win in all those five states. The Southwest, six states. The South South has six states. Yes. President Gula Jonathan will win in all those states. Okay. That is 11 states. 11. I'm going to 37. Yes. Now, in it's, the Southwest, yes, six to states. be very modest, yes. in the six states, President Gula Gabele Jonathan will win in four. Which are the four? Is Lagos one of well, them? Well, I, I don't want to name this because okay. I don't want to reveal this to the APC people. Okay. But I know that we are mobilizing a lot of people. Okay. We are talking to Nigerians. There are some people who are in APC who will vote for President Gula Gabele Jonathan. On the day of election. On the day of election. They are also scared about the kind of violence that we visited on them. Mm by their so-called leaders who are forcefully taking them to their So party. they are keeping it quiet. They are keeping it calm. But we are communicating. We are talking. They will vote for President Gulag. Okay. Okay. So, so now we, we have 15, 15 states from now the you south. Go to, you go to the north central. To yes. be modest again, the minimum we will get, the PDP will win, is going to be three states. North central. North central. So that's 18. That 18. Yes. If you move to the northwest, I can see the People's Democratic Party getting two states. And in the wow. northeast, we will get a minimum of one or two states again so i am generally looking at the people's democratic so party you've done your math yes it's nothing less than 21 states and the president will win in the fct so, so out of 37 we are likely to win the pdp will win a minimum of 21 to 22 states what if you lose we cannot lose this election it's not because it will be forcefully done. No. Yes. Nigerians have seen the difference between President Gulak and Billy Jonathan as a man who respects all Nigerians, a man who has given better opportunities to all Nigerians to operate. People are growing. Look at the entertainment industry today. Davido, Whiskey, P Square, all these guys don't need government patronage to grow and own what they, are, what they have today. It is the kind of environment and reform that an interest that President Gulag Village Jonathan has put into the entertainment industry that has brought about all this. So let us give this president and Nigerians are ready to come 28th of this month, come out and mass and vote for this president to be back for his last four years. It's not demanding for more than four years. Mm. These four years we put this country on an auto movement for progress and prosperity. <music>